expanding the brand. In these tough economic times, many companies are looking to bring in new clientele and new revenue streams. I'm Kelsey Hubbard, joined by Mark Fasora. He's chairman and CEO of the Hertz Corporation, and he is here to tell us about a new program that you're launching, uh, the Sharing Cars. This is a new thing for Hertz, uh, a traditional car rental company. Getting into this new business, uh, I hear the market share is upwards of a billion dollars. Uh, it's a big business. How do you plan to uh, take on your competition? Well, we look at our competition and we basically try to differentiate ourselves in a big way with technology. Um, our pricing per hour on car sharing is about 20% lower than our closest competitor. In addition, that $10 an hour includes a lot of features that no one else has. By having cars technology enabled like this, you know, that people with, that are tech savvy, like people in the 18 to 21 year segment or the 21 to 28 year old segment, those segments are important to us. We put technology in a car like Bluetooth, for example, hardwired into the car. We've got an iPod connector, allows you instant capability through the speaker system, hands-free. We give you a GPS never lost system. And the last thing that we have is what we call push to connect, which allows you to push a button and be connected immediately, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, to our customer care center. So your question is how big can it grow? We haven't forecasted, but it's certainly tens of millions of dollars, we think over the next 12 months. It's a, it's a big growth curve we think we can, and we have no capacity constraints. There's, there's nothing that's a, a limit on how many cars we can outfit with this technology. You're obviously in the business, you buy cars, you buy parts, uh, all of that. So how would that affect you if one of these companies or all three were not given this bailout? Oh, it's not healthy for us at all. Obviously, I mean, we buy a lot of cars from GM, Ford, and Chrysler. We want them all to do well and thrive. Um, I guess, you know, in terms of any one of them going under, it's, you know, it's a bad impact for us because we have one less car manufacturer to choose from in our fleet. I think that the whole system obviously needs help, but what you need to understand is that we're in a crisis now that no one could have predicted, right? So new car sales are off 40 to 50 percent. I mean, there isn't any business model that can, can, can basically survive on half of its planned volumes, right? All right. Well, thank you so much for your time. Uh -huh, thank Appreciate you. It. Thank you. I've been speaking with Mark Fasura, the CEO and chairman of Hertz. I'm Kelsey Hubbard in New York.